So you're thinking of moving to Guelph, Ontario? In this video, we're going to talk about everything you need to know about living in Guelph, Ontario. We're going to talk about the pros, the cons, the yin, the yang, everything that you may want to know if you're considering buying a home in Guelph, Ontario. And of course, you'll need to stick around to the end because that's when we're going to share the cons. Hint, hint, not very many of them. It's hard to find a con in Guelph, isn't it, Anita? <laughs> We are the royal city after all. So for those of you that are not quite familiar with Guelph and where it's located, we are a southwestern city, large town, small city in Ontario. We are just west of that GTA borderline, but we are just as good. We are about 70 kilometers west of Toronto. And if you travel a little further, then Kitchener will be another 25 kilometers more. Don't forget about London. We're on the way to London too. Ooh, yeah. Only about an hour away. Burlington, Oakville. We're just, it's a very centrally located city and it's very easy to live in this gorgeous city and commute to many of these areas. And if you're a fan of the beaches, then Port Elgin, Sauble Beach, two hour drive north. If you are a fan of uh, Port Rowan and so on, and you want to be on Lake Erie, again, probably an hour and a half to two hours south of us. Uh, it's, I've heard in my life for people that have moved here that Guelph is like this little pearl right in the middle of a gorgeous province of Ontario. So we're going to talk today about all the pros, all the cons, and you can get a better idea of what it's like to live here. So let's go. If this is your first time to the channel and you want to learn all about living in Guelph, Ontario, then be sure to subscribe. Tap the bell so that you get notifications on the current market in Guelph. My name is Anita and this is my partner Jenna and we work with Remax Hallmark here in Guelph under the Guelph Area Living Team. And every day we get calls or messages from people just like you wanting to know about what is it like to live in Guelph, Ontario or to move to Guelph, Ontario. And we are here to, to be your guides to show you what life is like in this beautiful royal city called Guelph, Ontario. So whether you're moving in nine days or 90 days, feel free to give us a call, shoot us a text or send us an email and we'd be happy to help you with your move to Guelph. All right, here we go with our number one pro, safety. Who doesn't want safety? Guess what? Global news, yes. Global news recently reported, and by recent we mean? Like three weeks ago. Yeah, they reported that Guelph was in the top 10. No, not top 10, top three. Top three safest cities in Canada. What do they, what do they look at? What do they study in order to be safe? They study, the police force. The police force. They study uh, the emergency response times. Yeah, efficient emergency services. And they study the crime rating index. So take those three together and Guelph being in the top three, we're a safe place, y'all. So this pro, you're going to love this one, Jenna. Growing up in Guelph, Ontario, I would say one of the main pros is that this small city feels like a big town. Everybody knows everybody. Yeah. Yeah. and you're just you know separated by two degrees of separation chances are if you went to high school or university in guelph yeah. you know somebody that i know <laughs> <laughs> the place where everybody just knows your name it's community so another popular pro for the city of guelph is that we have a university and where you have a university you naturally collect thinkers planners researchers and inventors there was a lot of things that were invented in guelph oh yeah guelph's got a lot of smart people did you know fun fact that the yukon gold potato was created in guelph i had no idea the yukon gold yeah. was created in guelph you can think guelph for getting those fabulous french crispy fries. french fries. French fries. <laughs> so next time you're dipping your fry in some ketchup, say thanks Guelph for the Yukon gold. Best french fries ever. Did you know some male athletes might thank us as well? <laughs> uh, I think maybe females would thank us Guelph for the male athlete protection that was invented in the 1800s. The jock strap. The jock yep. strap was invented in Guelph in the 1920s. Oh, sorry, I thought it was 1800s, but 1920s. Mm -hmm. Good job, Guelph. We're all about protection. All right, one of the other great things about Guelph is that it is prides itself on being a green city. G R E E N, green. We have so many initiatives in Guelph. It's always top of mind when it comes to everybody's agenda, and especially our political candidate. Did you know that we are one of the only cities 
to be represented by a Green Party member in the Ontario legislation. Yeah, Guelph is green. Again, another great pro for moving to Guelph or living in Guelph. Guelph currently has one of the lowest unemployment rates. It sits at 2%. This is a, a city of 150,000 people and almost everyone here has a job, a profession, a career. 2%, that's a fabulous unemployment rate. One of the pros about living in Guelph is the many options you have for education at all levels. We have public, we have private, we have great daycare, great preschools, high schools, elementary schools, technical programs through yeah. Conestoga okay. College. Guelph has its own campus. And of course, we cannot forget the University of Guelph, which is prestigious in its own right. Not to mention the OVC, which is the Ontario Vet College, which I believe it ranks about number three in the world right now. Three in the world, that's insane, right here in Guelph, Ontario. All right, so here we are going through our list of cons. Thank you for sticking around to the end for this. We don't have very many cons to share with you, but I can say the one thing that we as women figured out is that the local Guelph shopping mall, and we really only have one large shopping mall, is lacking an anchor department store. It does have some franchise stores, couple yep. brand names, but it really, really misses that big draw. Yeah, that department, department store. Another con that we have to share with you is Guelph is a growing city. Mm -hmm. So that means there's gonna be some growing pains. <laughs> yep, growing pains it is. Some of those growing pains might be the city run programs, they're in high demand. So you have to book early and you have to be ready when you're looking to sign up for some of these programs such as swimming lessons and community related events. Another growing pain of course is uh, infrastructure redevelopment. So you're going to find construction zones, road construction zones and blockages in different places during the summer months. Plus, of course, we have to mention inside of the growing pains, after all, we are real estate agents. There are lots of high density residential development scattered throughout the city. Growing pains. That's a lot of people they're putting in certain areas scattered throughout the city. Yep. And you're going to notice uh, more people at more places. So good, bad, pro, con, We'll let you decide. So we trust that you found this video helpful. If you're a resident of Guelph, Ontario, and you are watching our channel for the very first time, please share with us in the comments below, what do you love about our beautiful Royal City? And maybe some of the things that you don't. Because when you share your pro and your con, your advice helps people who want to make a decision about moving to Guelph, Ontario. There are a lot of fantastic neighborhoods there in are. Guelph. So many. And our goal is always to find you the best fit for your family. So whether you're moving in nine days or 90 days, feel free to give us a call, shoot us a text or send us an email and we'd be happy to jump on a Zoom call with you to discuss what may be the best fit for you. So if you're looking to move to Guelph or your conversation wants to be what it's like to live in Guelph, the contact information is below. Feel free to reach out. We'd love to chat.